back at you with another video from 80s Nut. Back at you with another video from 80s Nut. Alright, what I got for you today. This is the DCR 7220 Denon cassette pullout. Old school, Japanese made. It's a beast of a unit. Real, really good quality. Um, now, you'd be surprised at how many how many people are asking why the lights don't all come on when these units are wired up. Um, if the label is not there, and many of these decks through time, the label is no longer there. It's deteriorated, faded to nothing. And uh, anyway, so what ends up happening is you take your your yellow and your red, right? This is your auxiliary and your constant, and you put those together for your power, okay? And let's go ahead and wire it up and just kind of show you. Okay, so we take the ground, connect the ground, take your auxiliary and constant, and wire that up. And, okay, so it lit up, and, but there's an issue. The rest of the, the rest of the uh, buttons don't, light up and the accents around the treble, the bass, and the volume are also not lit up. And in some cases, they actually send a deck like this to me um, for repair. And uh, hey, I bought this deck from eBay. I bought it from a friend of mine and I try to hook it up and it doesn't, the rest of the lights don't come on, the LED lights. Um, and what it is, it actually doesn't need repair in most cases. All right, it's done. Um, took some time, but uh, it was better than sanding the entire thing, right? And uh, primering and then uh, painting. So, uh, and it saves, I'd say, 95% of the original uh, paint. So. This is the way I typically do it, and, uh, and when it's done, it looks really good. I'm still going to have to obviously do that bad boy, which is all chipped up and beat to crap. Uh, but again, I will not paint this piece. I will touch it up the same way I did on the amp. It's this wire right here, which is your orange with white stripe. So this wire would be connected to your power with your with your constant and your auxiliary and now you got the rest of the lights on um, so that I can't tell you how many how many people sent me uh, old school decks in for repair and it's not just Denon there is a number of different manufacturers that had that same issue or that same um, feature the, the old school Kenwoods did the same thing um, and some of the some of the Sony um, the ES series and some of the uh, come to think about it you know what? there's there's even Alpine decks that have that same uh, same feature so it would light up almost everything but the the rest of the deck wouldn't light up and that's because you need to hook up the other wire. So for Denon, the orange with white stripe lights up the rest of the uh, lights on the deck. Alright, that was just a quick video explaining that. Until next time, 80s Nut, out. Thanks for watching, 80s Nut, out.